Aquarius, hello beautiful soul, how are you? My name is Alicia, welcome. This is Empath Tarot, where spirit's messages directly correlate with being highly sensitive here on planet Earth. Now this is going to be a general reading, so if it does resonate, like, share, and subscribe so we can get spirit's message out there to fellow empaths. If you are interested in scheduling a personal reading with Spirit and I, all of the details are going to be down in the description box below. And for even more Empath Energy, check out my husband. You will love him. He gives such practical, easy to understand messages and guidance from Spirit, particularly in the niche of business. His information is going to be down below. But without further ado, let's dive right in and see what messages Spirit has for you. Moving forward, wow, wow, wow. This is definitely a positive time for you and your manifestations. Universe is valid validating that it's very essential that you get clear about what you want and get your emotions grounded because channeling this energy into what it is that you desire is going to bring forward a lot more mm, results than if you're um if at all you feel scattered with what you want, what's working, what's going on, what's the universe showing you right now, don't get don't get mix, mixed up in all this, this mess. Remember, Aquarius, you're visionary. Envision your final outcome of what you desire. Perhaps this is your happy family. Perhaps this is your finances. Perhaps this is the career you're in. Whatever it is that that is that end goal you have for yourself, visualize this. Keep your focus on this and simply allow the universe to guide you there by what feels good and your knowingness. And you will have this internal knowingness, Aquarius, so you never need to second guess if what you're doing is the right thing. The universe, again, will always guide you. And right now, it feels like a time where you simply just want to allow everything to unfold without forcing things. Whenever we are in the midst of going through any challenges or adversity, um, what's really happening is the universe is allowing us, giving us opportunities of growth. So we never want to look at our situation, no matter where we are, we are in life, as um, as 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 a victim um, mentality. We always want to look at it and think, okay, interesting. Now where can I go from here? Or what is it that I learned from this situation and how can I utilize it to push me forward? You know, never coming from a place of uh, losing your control or your power because I can see here that the universe has lined up something really juicy for you, Aquarius. Something is really going to be fun here entering your life and it's gonna come when you prioritize and structure and strategize yourself in a way where you're setting yourself up for success. That is the level of control of energy that is required to get you what you want because this is an intentional world and we must set intentions to uh, to uh, create our desires create our lives if we simply leave it up to chance or to what the universe is showing us we're then not creating we are then reacting when we react, we don't feel like we have the power. We don't feel like we have the control. It is not fun. It is not satisfying. It is not fulfilling. As a matter of fact, it's quite ungrounding and quite nerve wracking. And so it's important for us to be able to feel that de degree of control. And that's just by making sure, wow, making sure that you are again, prioritizing what's important to you. And I can see that because we have five reversal cards in a row. My reversal cards for me are always personal development, personal growth. So the universe is saying right now is a good time for you to take time out for yourself, Aquarius. Take time with yourself. Don't feel like you need to go be socializing. Don't feel like you need to go be the, you know, the 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 the, the star of the party at this time. Because I feel like your natural spirit is that. But I feel like just at this moment in life, don't feel like you need to stretch yourself so thin. Just take this time for yourself. Be with yourself. Get familiar with who you are. Know that in order for you to be your best self in this next transition, you're going to have to be very aware aware of where your energy is. Not stretch your energy too thin and not give it away to situations just because maybe it once was familiar, maybe it worked, maybe you feel like you need to or you um, it's, it's important of some kind. The only thing that's important is what your heart is asking of you. And you'll always know when something is right because you'll just have this guidance. It'll just feel like you're flowing into that situation. So when it doesn't feel like that, that's when you want to be open-minded to maybe second guessing and questioning yourself and thinking, okay, am, is this action step going to benefit me right now? Or is this a, is this a, um, a behavioral pattern that I'm just repeating because it's familiar, because it's what I feel like I'm supposed to do, right? We're not supposed to do anything. We're not shoulding. We're not supposing nothing of that, right? Anytime we're in the, I shoulds, I should do this. I should do that. I'm supposed to do this. I'm supposed to do that. Let all of that go. Release that. That creates a lot of tension and a lot of strain and a lot of resistance. And it's not necessary. 
Life should feel very effortless, very flowy. And I feel like right now, in order for things to flow in the right direction forward, you must be able to right now, at this time, more than ever, rely on yourself. And yourself will only come forward when you're clear about who you are by visualizing that outcome for you. I can see here that you have a lot, again, of um, financial strain being released very quickly here. We have the Five of Pentacles in reverse. So the universe is saying, if you take this time right now for yourself, Aquarius, get really familiar about who you are, what you want, establish uh, boundaries for yourself energetically right not not creating such a busy schedule for yourself that you're thinking like why did I do this right simply just relax resist resist re release resistance uh, you're going through some personal growth okay you're going through some through some major personal development and growth right now you may find yourself reflecting having finding yourself in a little bit of nostalgia it's completely normal but only take it as a form of empowering yourself okay empower it to push you forward know that soon that things are going to turn take a take a turn for you here and again there is a there is a, a love energy on the table there is a, a connection on the table but I, you know it's one of those things where the universe is asking for you not to focus on it. The universe is asking for you to simply just allow things to be um, and recognize that right now the only thing that you need to focus on is your success, um, fulfillment of yourself, because when you are fulfilled and successful with yourself, the rest will follow. Love will follow, money will follow, and I can see here that it's all here for you waiting to flow into your life, but again, it must come from you just taking some time out, taking some space for yourself, getting out of the social circles, getting out of of. of of the energy of the world and really just being with you being with you but from an empowering way being with you in an empowering way where you're like what do i want for myself what do i want to achieve what is the end goal i'm looking to desire and how am i going to get it guides let's go what are we doing here right and asking them but coming from a dominant energy as opposed to a scarcity energy whatsoever because it's just not who you really are Aquarius you, you are a, um, a powerful being and you create your world through your beautiful imagination so start to en engage in that now create 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 where do you want your career to go where do you want to see, where do you want your love to, to what do you want your love to look like what do you want the relationship to feel like how do you want to feel like? You know, now is the time to get clear. Now is the time to really reflect. Now is the time to, now is the time, as universe likes to validate, is to set those boundaries, right? Set those healthy boundaries. Don't feel like you got to do stuff because you're there or because it's accept, available to you. You know, a lot of the times we do things just because it's in front of us. You know what I mean? Like, for instance, when you go out to eat and you order a plate of food and there's something on your plate that you know, you don't necessarily want to eat. You said, no, today I'm not going to eat this. Today I'm going to stick to my goals. But because it's there in front of you, you eat it anyway, right? Just because it's there doesn't mean you need to do it. Just because it's in, it's show, universe is showing you this doesn't mean you need to do it, right? It's got to resonate with you. It's got to, got to, got to, got to resonate with you. Just because if the people, are, are, your friends are going out after work or people from work are going out and you feel like I should be part of this. Otherwise I might miss out. Otherwise they might forget about me. Otherwise they might make all these memories without me. No, if your spirit's like, dude, let's go home, let's open a bottle of wine, or let's, you know, make some yummy food, or let's put on our favorite show, let's just get our cozy socks on, whatever, right? If that's what your spirit's asking for you to do, do not deny your spirit. And the universe will always show you what's required, dragonfly spirit validating that, universe will speak to you in synchronicities when something comes up more than once that's how you know that's how you know again do not feel like you need to do anything right now Aquarius if anything the universe is saying don't do anything take time for yourself be with yourself regain your sense of self re uh, program your vibration to that of your higher self before you enter the world. Get those boundaries set in place. Watch for the signs from the universe. You know, universe is talking to you. Universe has been talking to you. Universe is talking to you now. And this is that validation for it. So do not deny yourself the right to live your most abundant life. Everything will come and go. There will be moments there will be moments again, there'll be opportunities again for you to get out there and for you to, uh, you know, be in the world. But right now the universe is saying, maybe just to hold yourself back from the world a little bit. Just take time for your healing, take time for you. But again, from a empowering way, 
because things are moving along here and things are going in the direction of your trajectory. Everything is looking really good. Everything is looking really good. And I do believe it's because you've already taken time to get in, get familiar with who you are and what you want. Keep going with it. Keep going with the practice. Always establish that dominant vibration of higher self and your higher self will always be your go-to in any situation. And that's the goal. That's the end result. All right, Aquarius, I hope you enjoyed your reading. I hope there was a message in here for you. If there was, like, share, and subscribe. I truly appreciate you. Spirit loves you. I love you, Aquarius. And until our next reading, keep shining, baby.